Good afternoon. My name is Hae Sung Kim, uh, advisor of Gangnam Labor Law Firm. Today we want to discuss about the unfair labor practice uh, that was published in a recent article. And uh, I would like to ask the background of this uh, incident to uh, Attorney Jung, Labor Attorney Jung Bong Su. So could you explain about the background? Yes. Uh, hello. Uh, how are you today? Uh, this is uh, Bong Su Jung, Korean Labor Attorney. Uh, yes, thank you for asking about uh, the labor case related to the unfair labor practice. Uh, uh, daily paper uh, showed, uh, reported about unfair labor practice uh, regarding some IKEA, the furniture uh, the selling company. So, um, uh, employer uh, violate the, uh, the unfair labor practice. So, uh, they uh, like uh, uh, Seoul High Court ruled um, their appeal was rejected because uh, uh, their conduct to control union members was uh, unfair labor practice. What happened about that company was that um, they had a labor dispute, then uh, union members, uh, were they had uh, some picketing. Picketing means that they take uh, some collective action in the workplace. So uh, their workers, uh, they wear some uh, the vessel or some jacket with a, a special note about uh, their demanding to the company. Like uh, uh, the they have a low wa wage or they need uh, uh, longer working hours than part-time work. So they um, the uh, they said in their uh, the jacket uh, describing their working condition. But with uh, such a uh, the uh, printed uh, clothes, they wore such a clothes and they worked in workplace. So company uh, decide to uh, divide or exclude those union members who were wearing such a jacket with a special uh, the, uh, some union uh, demand. Yeah. So uh, that was the case uh, later this unfair labor practice. So, uh, if uh, those uh, union uh, members were excluded uh, to uh, have uh, make a normal uh, labor work, uh, yeah. what will be the illegal matter that was uh, mm -hmm. implemented by the employer to yeah. the employee? So, employer's uh, perspective, so they needed to keep their peaceful management uh, wearing their company's uniform in the workplace. But union side, uh, without uh, collective action, like picketing, they um, wear a special jacket uh, to show their demand. So it was a conflict between uh, employees' rights and union's labor rights. So, uh, of course, uh, during the peace time, they cannot wear such a jacket with a special uh, some uh, claim. Uh, so, but in the uh, union dispute time, it is allowed to wear. It is a kind of a picketing in a union strike. So, uh, c like many union members, uh, they uh, wore uh, such a clothes with a special demanding word. So it is accepted by Korean labor law. So uh, this is a kind of uh, right to um, the collective uh, action. So uh, union has solid right of labor, like right to uh, organize labor union and right for collective bargaining and right to collective action. This uh, solid right is uh, protected by uh, the constitution of Korea. So you know to uh, implement uh, or uh, in order to uh, the, uh, protect uh, workers' right, uh, labor union act was uh, uh, the introduced. So uh, labor union uh, the, uh, um, the labor I mean the unfair labor practice means a violation of the solid right of labor. 
So uh, that is what the IKEA company violated. Uh, they excluded those uh, union members who uh, wore uh, such a jacket with a special uh, demanding order. So such a, uh, some giving discrimination or disadvantageous treatment to uh, union members, uh, uh, these uh, behaviors are regarded as unfair labor practice. So you are saying that because uh, the employer, the IKEA, has violated some uh, terms of the Korean labor law, That's right. and yeah. in such case, then they have they have the obligation to correct uh, what has happened. So, uh, so do you think that this will be settled down? Or? So yeah. So since the court ruled it was unfair labor practice, then. Employer must follow correction order, also correction uh, in their unfair labor practice. Uh, what they have to do is uh, they have to apologize to union. Uh, also, they have to announce uh, they will not repeat uh, their unfair labor practice uh, to the public. Uh, also, um, it may be possible they will be punished uh, by the criminal charge uh, because uh, uh, they uh, such a uh, unfair labor practice is regarded as uh, one of the uh, crimes uh, in the labor union act uh, yeah. so uh, now the the un unfairly uh, treated uh, labor will be normalized to work say again the unfairly treated uh, workers yeah, will be yeah will be you know recovered and they will be acting as a normal worker from now on because yeah, of yeah. the Korean so, Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So if they are discriminated, the uh, union members, uh, they could not receive uh, due to the employees' exclusion from work, then they have uh, a right to claim a uh, low paid wage during the uh, suspended period. So this one is a good example. So uh, how they can get a remedy or a correction order from the, uh, this court order. So uh, I hope this uh, IKEA labor union uh, can be regarded or accepted as a uh, equal the working decision making partner, so they can uh, conclude a collective agreement peacefully. Yes. Yeah, so uh, the reason why union takes strike is uh, due to the conclusion of the uh, the collective agreement. So collective agreements is the highest uh, rule uh, that is applicable t between union members and the uh, company. So the reason why they take strike is to make a better working condition in the uh, collective agreement. Yeah. Yes, I hope that the, the good result by the IKEA and mm -hmm. correction by them can be a good example for other foreign mm -hmm. companies who may have the similar uh, incident. So thank you very much for your comment. Okay, uh, I hope so. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.